Alright, so I've been skating this flight deck for about two weeks now. There's nothing really wrong with it, but I did just get this new hockey deck and I kind of want to skate it for today. So I'm going to transfer the trucks and then we're going to hit a couple street spots. Before I even start skating this deck, I do want to let you guys know that I have skated an FA deck before. An FA and hockey decks are basically made by the same people. So it does have a really similar shape in terms of the wide nose and the type of wood that they use. So I might already kind of be used to this deck, even though I've never skated a hockey deck before. For. but yeah we'll see how i like it and we'll see how it skates i've also been getting a lot of wheel bite recently so i did tighten my trucks and i am going to put just a little bit of wax underneath my wheels um because i just i do not like when i get wheel bite at all so yeah i think i'm just going to try a couple of flat ground tricks real quick and then move to the street spot that's literally like right across from the skate park but yeah just across from the skate park over there we have manual pad it's actually not that high coming up but coming down it is just a little bit of a drop but also I have skated this before it is really smooth on top and there aren't really any like cracks to interfere with anything So yeah, let me just ollie up try some flip tricks off real quick and then we'll get into some manuals I think I tightened my trucks just a little too much, but I feel like I'm gonna get used to it throughout the day First try kickflip. Oh my god, that was actually pretty good. Try one more time. What about hill flip? Oh, that was kind of sketch. Redo it. Kickflip felt way better for sure. It actually doesn't feel too heavy. I feel like there's like an extra ply of wood here that I'm not used to seeing on like regular FA decks. Even though this is a hockey deck, I do consider them like really similar. Yeah, but it does feel pretty light considering that. All right, let me try some manuals now. Try a regular manual and then we'll do nose back to back. I do like the fact that it's really smooth on the top. All right, let's go up now. Super sketch. But I did get him first try, so. I honestly feel like doing the nose manuals on that flight deck really helped me with doing them on popsicle decks. But now let's try it going up. Not as easy. There we go. All right, now let's try some flip tricks off this little mini drop. We'll go hip flip, hill flip. I kind of want to try like fakie tricks, so we'll see. when it pops up like that. I feel like the best way to kind of just like do stuff off drops is to think of it as regular flat ground, like flat to flat. Hill flip now. If you didn't see that. Let's try a couple manuals and then get back to the flip tricks. So manual 180s. First we'll go front 180 and then back. All right, let's see if back 180 is first try. Usually I'll like finesse it by just like pivoting and it usually works but since I'm like coming off from a drop I feel like it's a little different. I feel like I have to almost pop a little. There we go. Morning. 
I like this area because I feel like most of the people here are like super nice. But now, actually, let me get just a couple more kick flips and hill flips and then I'll do them fakey. I'm still getting used to this board kind of slowly. got wheel bite i feel like it's because my wheels are so big honestly i think i just need smaller wheels next time these are probably 54 53 millimeter i think i usually go with 52 from the start that was better the police just did this to me this community is like super chill not fakey <laughs> I gotta go faster and actually commit. Uh, all right, there we go. You recording me? Uh, yeah, I was taking some photos of the shadows. Is that cool? Yeah, that's cool. I just feel like I'm under pressure right now. You I'm gonna I'm try to commit. You're good, man. There's always somebody under these shadows. I don't mind, I don't mind. I'm gonna just try harder. I landed it the one time you weren't filming. Yeah, yeah, yeah I saw that. <laughs> My bad. Yeah, no. You were recording, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, hill flip. I feel like hill flip is like a little better, honestly. I feel like hill flips are like way easier to pop when it comes to fakie, especially coming off stuff like drop. Man, I can't, it made that turn. It's crazy, it went all the way like that. I know, right? It was like following the biker. I also like the graphic on this board because I, I don't think I've ever had like a gold, gold and black graphic. I, I, I like the vibes of it, like the mood of it. It feels like it's giving me good vibes. It's giving me skate vibes. All right, now let's try some just a little harder. Uh, we'll go kick flip manual and hill flip manual. And then a couple more flip tricks off this drop. And then we'll go back to the manuals. Eventually we'll get to another spot, probably one with some stairs. For right now, I just really wanted to warm up with this deck with manuals. I think kickflip manual is just gonna be a little harder because hill flip manual just comes to me naturally. I remember working on this trick for like hours and then once I picked up the hill flip manual it was just like just like that but that's how it is with some tricks. Technically that was kickflip manual 180 out technically but I didn't land it. I've done that once before though. How many boards have I broken? A few, quite a few. I've been doing this for like a couple years now, so yeah. Um, especially with decks like these, they have some like carbon fiber ones that are a lot stronger. Like you can almost roll over a car with them and they won't break. But yeah, with the wood ones, they do break pretty often, but they do last pretty well and they do feel a little better. So yeah. <laughs> I got you, man. All right, let me just land it already. Fake steez. I feel like I might have hill touched just a little. So let me just redo it just one more time. Let's do hill flip manual. And I'm pretty sure there's probably gonna be like first or second try. I was definitely getting cocky saying that would be first try. Oh, that was like a tad bit scrape. All right, let me do one more hill flip manual and then we'll get to a couple flip tricks off the drop. I'm thinking like tray flip and then nollie track. So yeah, let's get into that real quick. Came off the side a little, but that one felt like really nice. I haven't even done one on flat ground. Let me actually go in the skate park for this. Flat ground is way better in the skate park. Let me just do one over here and then one off the drop. 
I just, tray flips have never been my trick, even though like they're so popular. do nolly honestly i feel like there's gonna be a whole lot easier just because i usually do like nolly trays a lot more than regular tray flips see i'm already sticking out my second go let's try to commit right here It's such a light flick. Now let's just wrap it up with a couple manual tricks and then move on to a different spot. Ah, kind of weird doing it from a drop because I don't know if it's going to primo or not. Right now, maybe I just might just try manual kick flip out. I think I need to lean back just a little. Yes, let's go. Oh, and by the way, the board is feeling really nice. I'm getting a little used to the concave. That's one of the things that I probably had the most problems with, but now I do feel like with the flip tricks from the drop and just on regular flat ground, it is getting a little better. Getting used to the pop too. Those are the kind of things that I've just noticed off the bat from this one little Manny session. But yeah, let's go to the next spot. And I think we're gonna be skating stairs next. So yeah, let's get to that. So we're at this spot again. Last time I was here, I came with a couple homies. This time I'm here alone and it does look a little more crowded as people talking around the area we just got finished skating the manual pad now it's time for some stairs and yes i am wearing gloves i feel like when it comes to street skating specifically stairs i just want to protect my hands and not like rough them up too much if you want to know where i got these from these are just regular degler home depot gloves <laughs> I just don't want to get kicked out that's like the only thing i don't want especially because there's like a lot more people here than when we first came this one is the only four stair the rest are five stairs one four stair and then three five stairs back to back to back to back and honestly i think i'm just gonna warm up on the first set just to try all the tricks and then just skate the first two for today and then i'll probably like come back and skate all four next time <laughs> Oh yeah, and last time we came, bro, there was like this alarm that went off and we thought we got like reported or something. Let me get one more back one here. I feel like that one was like sloppy. Kind of want to do half cab, try that, and then some flip tricks. I honestly need new bushings. I don't know what it is about these bones bushings, but I just, I'm not liking them. Especially this one. This one is like falling apart. Now I've only been scanning them for like a couple weeks now. I gotta redo it. I like treating it like a double set. My phone keeps getting too hot to film, so I might just have like all GoPro ankles for this video, or at least most of it. Let me just let it cool in the grass while I try this kick flip. <laughs> Alright, come in right here. Alright, and I 
next try for sure if this wind doesn't mess me up. Oh my god. I just ate it. You can see my oh my gosh, bro. I ate it so bad. I definitely lost some skin up here. It's crazy how I get gloves for my hands, but end up injuring myself everywhere else. How did I not catch myself? All right, whatever. I know the people up there watching me are probably laughing right now. That was way harder than what it should have been. We gotta try some other stuff now. Maybe a hill flip to a back 180. I feel like that would be cool. I was gonna go for half cab, but something told me I wasn't going fast enough. All right, that was fun. Kinda wanna try a couple other things before I leave though, but I definitely need like clean this up, do something about it. Can't spend too much time out here. But now that I think about it, I am getting a lot more used to the shape of the board. I definitely need to do something about my bushings though. I feel like that's part of the reason I messed up on that one kick flip. <sighs> Let's try one more combo on the double set. I wanna try hill flip to back 180 to half cab to regular ollie. Or I might just throw Throw another hill flip to be honest. Imagine I get it first try. I forgot to buckle my helmet. Once I get this first trick, I'm gonna be on the roll. Bro, that felt so good. I felt like I had enough speed for the hill flip though. That felt so good. I felt like I was going so slow for the back 180 though. And like I said, all these other stair sets are five stairs. So I feel like I need to push in between those rather than the first set because the first one is a four stair. Still kind of bummed out. I did eat it on a kick flip, a four stair kick flip. I've kick flipped eight stairs before and it was out of street spot too. So I know I can easily kick flip this, but yeah, I guess that's gonna be the end of this YouTube video. Um, definitely let me know if you guys want me to finish this line come back and get it because i definitely can i know i can do it but yeah that's gonna be the end of this youtube video and i'll see you guys later i'm out